Hey guys, today I'm going to be showing you a quick and easy way to get this robot vision effect directly in Premiere Pro. So let's show you the example and get right into it. First I'm going to take this video, we have a girl doing kettlebell swings, maybe her personal trainer is a robot, and we're living in a reality where robots don't want to hurt us, but they actually want to, you know, strengthen us. That's a world I hope for. Okay, so let's get into it. I'm going to drag this into a new sequence. Now that's in a new sequence, what I'm going to go to do is effects, extract, drag that onto the footage. We're going to drag the white input level to about 91, and we're going to drag the black input up. Now you can make this as thin or as wide as you like. It could be super pixely if you do 90 and 91. Then you'll only see like outlines, like very small little outlines of the action. That might be really cool. It might be something you're going for. Um, but for this, I'm going to take the black input and drag it down just a little bit so we can get some more. And I'm going to drag the softness up something around 70. So now that we got that, we're going to go to effects, we're going to go to tint, we're going to drag tint on, we're going to effect controls, and now you can make your robot vision whatever color you'd like. So um, it could be a nice red, maybe she's in danger of this robot trainer, it could be green, that's cool, it gives it kind of a night vision look. Um, I'm going to go with green. Okay, from here, what I want you to do is Alt-Drag Up. So you'll make a duplicate copy. And then you're going to go into Effects and grab my favorite effect, the Gaussian Blur. And you're going to drag that on top. You're going to go back into Effect Control, set the Blend Mode to Linear Dodge Add. Then you're going to go to your blurriness. And you're not going to do too much. Maybe, let's see, 30. All right, 30 is a good place for me. If this is too glowy for you, you can always go into the opacity and, you know, change that however you like. So I'm going to put this at 65, so it's not too overwhelming. And the last thing I want you to do to get that digital vision effect is we're going to drag an adjustment layer on top. You're going to go to Effects, Turbulent Displacement, drag that on your adjustment layer, Effect Controls, scroll down. You're going to turn the size down to something like 10. You can keep the amount at 50. You're going to click on Displacement, and you're going to choose Horizontal Displacement. Now what you're going to do is you're going to go to the beginning of your clip. You're going to keyframe the evolution. Go to the end of your clip. And this is just how much you want the displacement to move. I'm going to do 10. So do 10x, and we'll render it. And then when it's done, we'll watch through what we created. OK, so now that that's rendered, let's take a look at it. Awesome. And there you go, a quick and easy way to get a robot vision effect directly in Premiere Pro. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. There's a lot of different ways you can go with this effect, and I would love to see your examples. If you have any, please send them my way. I would love to see what you guys can do with this. So please leave a like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. Thanks.